new year, new season, senior year. What are your goals at the end of this year? Win. Go one and out. That's about it. I mean, my preparation this summer is scary almost. I say I was almost in hell every day. I prepared. So, uh, you know, my preparation will take care of what I need to take care of on the floor. Hopefully, go one and out. That's our goal. Once Spencer went down, you played a lot of point guard last year. Are you hoping to kind of carry on that role this season? Is all that a goal? One. All one. I want to play point guard from the jump. Um, I might move, you know, to the two. You know, Dominique comes in or Xavier, whatever coach wants pretty much. But I, I, I plan on playing the one as soon as the game starts. So yeah, obviously you guys have been on the court during offseason workouts, but does today feel different just because it's that first official one? Yeah. I mean, coach is on our head from the jump. Like, we're not sprinting to the line. And, you know, he made us run early. So I think, you know, from there on out, we have to keep our energy up and it felt good. Talk about the Navy SEALs experience this year. Uh, it, it went well. You know, it's tough. They, they yell at you. They hassle you. They, they make you do things you're not used to, especially out there at the, the reservoir, you know, in the water. And it's, it's a difficult task, but at the same time, you know, you get to see how tough your team is and how, how tough your teammates are. How'd the swimming go? It went fine. For everybody? Yeah. No yeah. one really had a problem in the water. Um, not everybody knows how to swim, but we had light vests on, so everybody was fine. Who were the toughest boys on the spot to map? Uh, probably Josh Scott, myself, uh, Dustin, those type of guys. Those guys did very well. From your perspective, who improved the most from last season, from what you've seen? Mm, that's a good question. Um, myself. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I've, I've seen, you know, Fletch, you know, he's he's become a better shooter, a little better ball handler. And hopefully, you know, I think he's taken full advantage of his time sitting out from his knee. And um, I think he, he's been in the weight room, you know. Xavier Johnson, for sure, you know, he's been working on his game. I think everybody's a little bit better. But I know for, my, for sure, I can only speak for myself, I, I'm tremendously better. The score from the pit game, I believe, was posted around here. Was that up all summer? Is that still around? It's still around. Uh, from the day we lost to now, it's been up. Um, Coach probably isn't going to take it down. Cause he's going to keep reminding us. Maybe once the season starts, you know, because that's in the past. But at the same time, he's going to keep reminding us. We don't ever want to lose that bat again, whether it's to Arizona, whoever it is. I don't care if it's the first game. And if we lose that bat to Drexel, I'll be disappointed. So. Um, yeah, it doesn't matter who it is. We're just going to you know, try to take one game at a time and move on from the past. What was your motivation to work so hard over the summer? <laughs> it was a, n a number of things, man. Uh, probably one of the first things was the, the pit game. Um, I felt embarrassed. I was pissed off. You know, uh, I, I sucked that game flat out. I mean, I, I own up to it. I take full responsibility. I didn't you know, do my part. and. Uh, I didn't want to have a performance like that again. And I'm not saying every game is going to be perfect or I'm going to, you know, be the best I can in every game, but I'm going to, I don't want anything happen like that again, you know, especially lose by 30 on a national floor.